I've got the look that drives a girl wild. I've got the mood that really moves them. I said she up, up and down their spine. I'm just a sexy boy. I'm not your boy toy. I'm just a sexy boy. I'm not your boy toy. I make them hot. Mr. K I B B L E S in this world, yeah, I'm the best. In this world, yeah, I'm the best. In this world, yeah, I'm the best. Phenomenal, phenomenal. Sweet chick music bomb you. Help every title, this ain't new. Always one no number two. Don't know lie, I am the truth. Six times, three times, two times, one you shine now, but I'm the sun. Nothing to prove to if you're fun. Cubes clash, get all you're done. Like gang green, I stop your run. I style is AJ, Mr. Rum. That minute if you still a scum. I'm a champion, you a bum. I do what I do and I'm doing it well. Body slam, so do the hell. Fight for liberty, ring the bell. Time to play the game! <laughs> All right, BYTW final show, and it is a tag team TLC match between two teams that have never faced each other in the history of BYTW. It is the Brothers of Destruction, Wolf and Beast, versus the actual brothers, Kibbles and Pat, who do not have a cool team name. Oh, well. And here we go. The double teaming has begun as all these men... Oh, my God, a hard shot. Beast just came right at Kibbles with that steel chair, and he goes right after Pat as well, knocking both men down, trying to win this matchup. You win this match by pinfall or submission. And Kibbles is getting set up. He's got, oh my god, Wood right into the face. Wood right into the face. Can we get a replay of that? And, the, oh, there's the replay as the Wood goes right into the face of Beast. And Wolf throws him right into the ladder. And it did not take very long in this matchup to have the weapons come into play. And now you can see Pat trying to make Beast give up. Trying to make him submit as Wolf spins around. With a hard spinning DDT off of the ladder. as Pat, And there comes Wolf right in there making sure that Pat does not make... A beast submit and it could be double choke slam time this could be it if they hit this and no they double choke slammed them but luckily kibbles was able to move the wood out of the way which is going to reduce the damage a lot folks you don't think it would but it does it reduces the damage a lot as he does not go through the wood Gibbles was trying to fight off bro both members of the Brothers of Destruction, but to no avail as he gets dropped down by Wolf. The numbers game was just a little too powerful, and I think it's double team time. There's a backbreaker. He feeds him right into Beast, and there's a spine buster by Beast as Beast drops him down and throws up the hands. <coughs> Posing, he goes for the pin cover one. Two, and Kibbles was able to kick out before the count of two. As you can see in the background there, Pat trying to fight off Wolf. Oh, there's a kick right to the hamstring as Beast goes down. Beast goes down with the kick, and now it's a double team time from Kibbles and Pat as they're throwing the wild stereo round kicks. Kicks that the Kibbles brothers, the Kai brothers, are famous for as they're throwing those stereo round kicks, knocking Beast all over the place. He goes after Wolf. Oh, no. And Wolf drops him with a drop toe hold right down onto the ground. And, oh, Beast drop. Uh, I'm sorry. Wolf drops Kibbles with a drop toe hold, dropping him right into the face of the chair. Right into the chair as he goes down. And you can see there both. Oh, no. He. They're, the Kai brothers are trying to fight out of this. They're trying to fight out of this. They got a hold of each other's hands. They might be trying to pull each other back. Oh, no. But it, to no avail, Pat was stuck in the middle. Pat got stuck in the middle, and that allowed Wolf to take advantage of Kibbles because both men did not get out of the way of that move. He's bringing him up and drops him down. He just drops him down. Steel chair across the back. Oh, my God. There's the replay of the steel chair shot across the face. But Kibbles was able to fight back as he lands a drop kick on Wolf. And there's Pat hitting Beast in the background. As you see uh, Kibbles come around, pendulum elbow drop. I think we're going to get a better look. Yes, we're going to get a better look of the hard wood shot to the face that Beast took. And now Pat's lining him up. Oh, there's a punt kick. A punt kick right into the chest of Beast, knocking him down. And Pat is known for those deadly kicks. One, two, no. Both 
both Cobb brothers trying to cover up Beast, but it did not work. It did not work. Oh, no. Wolf's got him around. He could be dropping him with the FU. Yes. He drops him down FU. Going a little old school here. And, oh, there's a ladder right into the gut of Beast. A ladder right into the gut of Beast. And Wolf has got kibbles. He's throwing hard shots. Hard shots. You can see Beast in the background. What the hell is he doing? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. He's... They freaking killed himself. Oh my god. He tried to jump and put, tried to elbow drop Pat through that, but Pat moved and it looked like Beast was trying to change his trajectory mid air to stop himself from getting hurt. You can see the cameraman's trying to run in there to get a better look at Beast. And Beast is definitely feeling the pain. He's definitely feeling the pressure. He went flying off that ladder and hit the ground with a lard. Lard. With a large thud. As you can see there, Wolf was able to stop the pin cover. I don't know if. Beast would have been able to kick out of that if Wolf had not been there. Kibble stopping Beast from doing the FU through the table this time. He comes around. Oh my god, Pele kick. Pele kick as Wolf Wolf is steered up. Oh, there's a kick as he goes right through the wood. Wolf goes right through the wood. And there's your replay right there as Pat kicks Wolf right through the wood. I believe that's our first table break of the match in the TLC tag match. Oh my god. And then Pat goes right after Wolf. There is no waiting. There is no sitting around. Pat's got a hold of him. He's got him up and drops him down. Drops him down with DDT. And these two men are going up. Could be looking for a little old school. Could be looking for the Hardy Brothers. Yes. Pulling a page out of the Hardy Boys playbook. Flying. Flying off of the ladder in the chair. Delivering a leg. Dropping a body splash. Event Omega. And there's your replay of Event Omega. As Wolf walks across the other side of the screen. You can see Wolf is trying to set up for something. He's trying to set up another piece of wood for something. Last time he set up a piece of wood, it did not work out very well for him. He was dropped. Oh, no. He's got Pat up. No. Oh, my God. Power bomb. No. Oh, my God. He goes through the table. Oh, my God. Through the table. Pat just went through the table with a power bomb. And this could be it if Wolf can get muster enough strength to get over there and go for a pin. As you see that there's a replay right there. Drops him down. Can we get a replay of another angle? I think we're going to get one more replay of the power bomb through the table. And this could be it for Pat. But you can see Wolf is too tired. And he can't capitalize on the punishment. And there's Beast. Beast being a good teammate. One. Two. And Pat was able to kick out. It was just a little bit too much time. And Pat was able to kick out a little too long between the power bomb and the cover. He's got him up. Oh my god. Concerto. They didn't do it with uh, with chairs, though, so I would assume it might be Kunwudo. As he drops him down, goes for the cover. One, two, and Pat kicked out. Pat kicked out before the count of three. And Beast, you can see there, is not happy. Got him up. Could be looking. Oh, pulling a page out of his partner. Sweet Chan Miozak. Sweet Chan Miozak. You saw Wolf was trying to pull a, a move out of his partner's playbook and deliver an F5. But he got Sweet Chan Music for his effort as Kibbles kicked him. Beast trying to grab a hold of Kibbles and stop him for the pin cover, but but Pat grabbed a hold of him. He's got the ankle lock locked in. Ankle lock locked in. Kibbles went after Wolf, but no. Oh no. Oh no. Sharpshooter. 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 These two men are locked in the sharpshooter. These two. Oh my god. Sharpshooter and ankle lock. Sharpshooter and ankle lock. Beast. Oh, there's a punch by Kibbles. There's a. Oh, punch by Kibble. There's a punch by Beast. And now Beast was trying for a punch. Kibbles was trying for a punch. And now they're trying to stop each other from punching each other. And then the, with the ankle lock and the sharpshooter locked in. What a maneuver here. You could see Beast and Kibbles were locked inside of these submissions. Then they were trying to punch each other to try to deliver these moves to stop them. To try to get them to kick out. And there's Pat. There's Pat. Hurricane Rana. Hurricane Rana. Right into the chair. Hurricane Rana. Right into the chair. Beast. It's got a piece of wood. And there's Pat. Drop to hold. Drop to hold. As Beast goes into the chair as well. Both men are now laying there. Here comes Kibbles. With a piece of wood. Drops it. Kibbles drops it across the back. He And he's not done there. There's Here comes a chair. A chair across the back. Of Wolf. And Beast. Oh and there's Pat. With a hard shot to Beast. As Beast stumbles down to the ground, you can see that this match is taking its toll. And there's a shot. There's a shot. And Wolf and Kibbles. Wolf and Kibbles come flying. Wolf and Kibbles come flying off of the chairs. Knocking down both men. And you can see there, Kibbs, Kibbs uh, showing off to the camera a little bit. He uh, might be a little too confident. Oh no, Pat. He's got it locked in. Uh, pedigree. 
pedigree. Pat goes down with the pedigree. And this could be it. This could be it, but for some reason, Wolf is telling his partner to climb the ladder. Why the hell is Wolf telling his partner to climb the ladder? I don't think that's a good idea. I don't think that's a... Oh my god, Beast comes flying. Beast comes flying, and he takes out Kibbles and Pat. He takes out the Kai brothers. He came flying off that ladder, and Wolf was able to hold them in place just long enough to go down. There's a replay. I think we want to get one more replay. One more, yes. There it was. Wolf was able to hold the Kai brothers there long enough as his brother of destruction teammate. Beast came flying off of that ladder to take both of them up. And I think that they should have went for a pinfall here. I think Wolf and Beast should have gone for the pin cover and won this match. But I don't think that's how they want to win. They want to deliver one more final blow. It looks like they're setting something up. Double choke slam by Kibbles. Sweet chin music. Sweet chin music. And Pat with the stunner. Pat with the stunner off of the sweet chin music. Pat with the stunner off of the sweet chin music. And now he throws Beast into the ladder. And you can see there, Beast is trying to climb the ladder. Beast is trying to get the hell away from Pat. He's trying to get as far away from Pat as he can. And that's why he's climbing the ladder. But I don't think it's a good idea. Beast might be a little loopy here. He's not thinking straight. He's now on top of the ladder with the Kai brothers up there with him. And that cannot be good. That cannot be good. They're trying to knock him off into that piece of wood. But Beast is reeling. He's reeling. He's reeling. And there's a shot. He knocked Pat off of the chair next to him. Kibbles with a kick. And Beast goes down. Beast goes down. Beast goes down. Kibbles came across with a kick across the face. And Beast goes down. There's the kick. And then crunch. He crunched through that piece of wood and he flipped right over almost falling flat on his face boom he goes down if one of the Kai brothers can get over there for a pinfall that will be it for this match one two three and here are your winners of the tag team TLC match it is Pat it is Kibbles. Your winners are the Kai brothers and a heartfelt match. The first ever meeting and the last ever meeting.